Hello grade 5, how are you? We will make revision on what we covered last week. Macmillan book, unit 1. The quest. New vocabulary. What's the meaning of the quest? Quest, a long search for something that's difficult to find. Mystery. A thing that you can't understand or explain. Fishing net. And it's used by the fishermen to catch fish. Harpoor, a place where ships or sports can stay on the beach. Gulf, a large area of sea surrounded on three sides by a coast. Wreck, a ship or vehicle that has been badly destroyed. Creature, a living thing such as an animal or a bird a fish or an insect, but not a plant. Worth, having a specified value. Kindness, to be a kind-hearted, gentle, or to have a good feeling to someone or something. Fear, the feeling of fright and horror or panic. For example, for example, I fear. Spiders and cockroaches. Massive, very huge or it's enormous. Calm, peaceful and quiet without hurried movement and anxiety or noise. Mend means to fix or repair. Lean, lean to slope in one direction or to move the top uh, part of the body in a particular direction. Monsoon, monsoon, the season of heavy rain in southern Asia or the wind that begins the rain. Disappointed, to have a sudden feeling of failure about something or someone. Valuable, Precious, valuable adjectives means precious. For example, jewelry is available so thieves intend to steal it, to steal it. Engine, the part of a machine that changes uh, energy into movement. Sink, sink here uh, verb, to go down under the surface of the water. Gasp. To catch your breath when you ha when you are surprised or afraid of something. Pre uh, reverse, reverse. Go backward or to change the direction. Uh, order positions results something to its uh, opposite. Fortune teller, fortune teller. Is a person who tells people what is going to happen to a person in a future, in the future. Opposites, rough, the opposite of rough, calm, expensive, cheap, perfect, imperfect, huge, tiny, cloudy, clear, clever, stupid, uh, prepositions, a verb is, uh, which comes with uh, prepositions. Look up means to become better. Look round to visit a place and look at the things in it. Look at to think about a subject carefully so that you can make a decision about it. Some exercise to make revision about vocab. Choose the correct answer. The book tries to explain some of the... Mysteries, uh, mysteries of the event. Rainforests are filled with amazing... The fence is... To the right. Dash tells people what will happen to them in the future. Bravo. Four. 
Titanic is a ship which sank or acted or moved in 1912. The car into the parking space. Nothing will stop them in there. The danger of ship. Now we move to grammar, present symbol, uh, and present continuous. Present continuous con uh, is a form uh, form of am is are plus verb plus ing. We took it before. Uh, we make revision about keywords now. Look, listen at the moment when we see one of these words in a sentence. We put a sentence in present continuous. M is R plus verb plus ING. For example, I am uh, Omar is going to school now. Ahmed and Sara are fishing at the moment. Listen, she's playing music. Present symbol consists of uh, uh, singular nouns, singular pronouns, and the plural pronouns. Uh, Omar, for example, Omar goes to school every day. L I will be with you with they, I, we, you, and they, uh, plus infinitive. He, she, it, take verb plus verb plus s. He, she, it, and singular noun, like Omar goes. Here we put es because Omar is a singular noun. Some key words in uh, present simple like uh, every usually sometimes uh, often uh, never rarely okay now we want to make revision how to change the sentence uh, rewrite the sentence with the correct word uh, the, number one they watch tv every day i want to put at the moment and here we want to change this sentence in present symbol we want to change it in present continuous delete every day and put instead of, of it uh, at the moment they watch the TV every day they uh, try to answer the TV at the moment but when we want to put at the moment we change watch Two are watching. They are watching the TV at the moment. Number two, they go fishing every day. They go fishing every day. I want to put how often. How often? Plus how often? W H question in present symbol. How often? Plus do or does plus subject plus infinitive. They go fishing. Number three, she never fin finished her work on time. I want to delete never and put not. <laughs> Finish her, her work on time. Don't put never in a negative sentence because it is the same meaning. When I wanted to say she never finished her work on time, the same meaning when I said she doesn't finish her work on time. How often again? He goes to club once a week. We delete once a week and but how often? <laughs> Does he go to the club? To club? Uh, is she happy today? <laughs> Are they happy today? I want to change it from singular to plural. I don't go, number six, I don't go shopping alone, rarely. Meaning with never. I rarely go shopping alone. Correct the verb. Hurry up. Hurry up. And exclamation mark means hurry up. I, I speak to, to you now. 
I want to put the sentence in a present continuous. The bus wait outside or <laughs> is waiting outside. He studies English at the moment. the moment she get taller and taller <laughs> my mother is picking a cake I want to ask her questions <laughs> what is your mother doing okay thank you grade 5 this is uh, the first unit about the quest in Macmillan see you next session